How to increase affiliate sales and commissions in 2023 in just three steps. G'day, I'm John Newman from Make Money Online Affiliate Marketing.com, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can increase your affiliate sales and commissions in 2023 in just three steps. But before we do that, uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you can be updated whenever I do another one of these videos. So, how do you increase your affiliate sales and commissions this year? Let's get into it. Okay, so how to increase your affiliate sales and commissions in 2023 in just three steps. So um, here's a quick overview and I'll just run through the points a little bit further. So number one, build an email list. Now, the money is in the list. Now, you may have heard that before, but, you know, that's 100% true now. 100% true. Now, a lot of people, most people, especially starting out, they don't want to build an email list. They've got a real phobia against it and they think it's going to be too hard, take too long. And all the rest of it now while you know it does take a long a little bit of a while to build it a big email list um that really is the secret to making money online all the big marketers you know they sell all these products a lot of shiny objects i call them and say you're going to make money overnight and all the rest of it and you know some are okay some are not so good but the fact is they've got big email lists and they email out offers to these products and all other vendors different products and they make sales because they've got a big email list and a big email list to buy. So it really is the secret to making money online. And, you know, honestly, it's a numbers game. You know, if you build your list, the more people you got on your, the list, the more money you're going to make. It's just, um, you know, it's the way it happens. Like it's, it's often said, you know, if you've got, you make a dollar for every subscriber on your list. Now, these days, it's probably about 50 cents for every subscriber on your list. Um, but, you know, that's that's true. So if you've got ten thousand people on your list, um, essentially you should be making you know five thousand to ten thousand dollars a month from people on that list. So you know what it might take you a while to build that up. Now some of these big markets have got hundreds of thousands of people on their list. So you know that they obviously you know they make fifty hundred thousand you know a month. That's what that, that's what they do because they, they've built their list that way. Now this does take time, and people don't like to. You know, people don't like to say that, you know, it takes time to build up a massive list like that. But, you know, that really is the secret. It's a numbers game. So, you know, please don't discount it. You know, it, honestly, you know, having an email list is the most valuable asset and money-making ATM, basically, that you can get. If you've got a reasonable size email list, you send um, emails out, you make sales, you make money. It's as simple as that. So it really is vitally important to build an email list right from the start when you're learning to make money online. Um, take it slow, build it build it slowly and steadily. Um, scale it as you go, you know, and you, you will be successful once you can start building your email list or start making money online. And that's, that's a fact because it is a numbers game and the money is in the list. It's absolutely true. So definitely take that on board. So, But the secret of it, there's a few things you, you need to do with it as well. So you need to have a high converting opt-in page and bridge page. So you need an opt-in page or a landing page where you gather email addresses and then they go onto your email list. But a real secret is also having a high converting bridge page. So when people opt onto your email list, they can then go onto your bridge page, which basically pre-sells the offer that you're promoting. So it gives a bit of information. So then they go onto um, the offer, the sales page, and you're more likely to get a sale that way because they've been pre-sold the offer because they're coming in basically cold traffic. Um, you know, so it sort of pre-sells it, you're more likely to make a sale. And then you have email follow-ups to that same offer and, you know, you will make sales down the track. It's often said you need like about six or seven points of contact before a sales is made. So you will make sales straight up out the bat with a bridge page, you're more likely to make more. Um, but, you know, as you do more and more follow-ups down the track, um, then you start making a sale down there as well. So it, it is vitally important to, to, to mail that list. So I'll just give you a, a quick example of an high-converting op opt-in page, one of mine. So this is one of the ones I mainly use here. So um, it's a little bit blind, but this converts at about 50%. And the reason I've got it blind is because like, I do a lot of solo, um, get a lot of traffic from solo ad providers. So basically I pay a big marketer 
a certain percentage for a certain amount of clicks to this opt-in page. So if I'm paying a dollar a click, click for example, say, and I pay $100 for 100 clicks, I'm then getting 100 clicks to this opt-in page. Now, this converts at 50%, so I'm getting 50 um, subscribers to my email list on my page. So, you know, so I'm, uh, as you do that, you know, you're, you're building your subscriber base as you go. So and then it clicks to confirm. You know, it sort of gets people, um, you know, confirm you're not a robot and they enter their best email address there. So that's, you know, an example of that. And an example of a bridge page, then they'll come to this page here. So it's telling people, check your, your email for limited time. Please check the spam um, folder as well because, like, often it, it can go to spam as well. First up, you try and get them to whitelist your email. So here I've got a video for myself. This is promoting one of my or pre-selling one of my products, ATM Profits. So I've got a video there of myself pre-selling the offer. I've got some earnings proof, some of my earnings proof that I've got on the page there. And that's basically it, just a, a you know, telling them a little bit about the offer there. And then if they click this, these links, it goes on to the sales page. So there's an example of it there. So uh, just go back over here now. So, but if you're doing solo traffic and you're paying for doing paid traffic, you know, you've got to have good traffic sources because you may have heard some bad things about dirt, certain solo ad, um, solo ads, uh, uh, crap and all that sort of stuff, you know. Some of it definitely is. Some of it's absolute rubbish, but there are also some really good traffic sources out there, traffic providers that, you know, get my sales continually, you know, and where it gets to the stage where, you know, the tra what I pay for traffic, you know, is basically recouped and I get that cost back. And then after that, I'm building my email list and the more times then I mail, you know, it's, it's all profit after that as I go, but also put money back and, and scale that to um, get more people, more traffic, more more clicks to my offer and more people on my email list as well. So it's good to have good traffic sources. And you also need high converting email swipes. So, you know, that, that's something that takes a little bit of a while, but I always keep a swipe file of, of really good swipes that I've got and swipes that I've seen. I don't copy and paste people's swipes, but I change them around a little bit, change the headlines, change the, the, the body of, of the email as well, you know, and take it to my style. So it's a good way to keep... Um, going. So you need high converting swipes that are going to convert and convert. It gets the opens and it gets the clicks more importantly and then obviously you get the sales. So um, that's very important. Also, you've got to have good list hygiene. So what I mean by that is you need to, to clean your list. If you've got um, people that aren't opening your, your list, opening your mails, um, you, after a certain amount of time, you've got to delete those out. And you know when you're paying for traffic, people don't like doing that as well, but you need to do that because you need to keep your open rates up, um, which you know helps you get them better delivery. You don't get in trouble with your autoresponder um, company, and not only that, there's no point paying for a subscriber if they're not opening your email. So it's it's because like, you know people will put in fake emails um, or put in one of their emails that they don't check for, for months and months and months. So you're not going to get sales if they're not opening and clicking on your emails. So. Um, you definitely need to keep it clean, keep your percentages up, um, and you know it's just good hygiene to do that. And you get better delivery when you do that as well. So, and the most important thing to remember about this is, if you don't mail, you don't make money. If it, people sometimes get scared about emailing their list, now don't be scared of people unsubscribing either. You know, people won't like your email if you email six times a day. People say you're emailing too much, they'll unsubscribe. If you email four times a day, they'll do it. If you email once a day, they'll still say too much email once a week people still unsubscribe and sometimes i get emails that i haven't got from some people for months and i'm like well i haven't seen you in my inbox and then i'll, I'll more likely unsubscribe from them so people will do that but you've got to um, sometimes people are a little bit like squirrels that they, they need to see you in the inbox constantly as well um, to know that you're still about and, and remain relevant so and just remember if you don't mail you don't you don't make money so don't be scared of emailing your your list you need to do that as well so that's um, step one step two is you need to find high converting offers so uh, the platform that I mainly um, use is warrior plus because that's you know it's I'm in the make money online line niche I promote products that teach people various ways and strategies to make money online uh, and the reason being people have an insatiable appetite for these type of products I mean people you know, want to make money online. They want to create an online business and 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 you know create financial freedom and earn an extra so money through a side hustle and stuff like that. So people are looking for this. 
So, you know, there's a there's a, there's a massive market for this sort of stuff that's only going to get larger. And Warrior Plus is one of the main platforms for this. Um, to a lesser extent, there's ClickBank, uh, Digistore24, there's also JVZoo. Um, they're the main ones I use, but mainly on Warrior Plus, Digistore24, and a little bit on ClickBank, I pretty much use it. Pretty much don't promote hardly anything ever on JVZoo. Um, and the reason being is because you get like you get 50% um, to 100% commissions on the front end. Now, while they are low ticket, they generally could be from um, seven to seventeen dollars, something like that, on the on the front end. Um, you can um, get 100% commissions on all of those products, or 50%. Um, whereas, you know, if you're promoting Amazon products, you're getting like 2% commissions and that sort of stuff. So it can be lucrative as well. And there's also upsells. You need something with a funnel there uh, and you're getting 50% commissions. Now, these can be ranged from $20 to $150 upsells or even $297 upsells um, that you can get 50 to 100% as well. So um, it, it, it's far more lucrative to do it that way as well. And also, look, then, a lot of them offer a license rights where you can get a bump. So on the on the back end products that are normally fifty percent, you can get bumped up to eighty percent to hundred percent commissions. And when you are using paid traffic, you know this is very very lucrative. And you know if you get a full funnel sale, you might make three or four hundred dollars or something like that on from just one customer in like a couple of minutes. And it's you know if you if you get three or four hundred dollars in a couple of minutes, you think wow, you know this is this is sensational. It does happen more often than you think. Um, so it's very, very lucrative. So uh, I'll just have a quick look at Warrior Plus here now and just show you what I mean. So if you come in here to your Warrior Plus account, you've got to sign up for an account, verify and all that sort of stuff. But come in here to affiliate and you look in offers and you click there, you'll come to these affiliate offers and you can request approval. So just for example, um, look at this one. If you're going to request, you'll open it up and it'll come in here and you can request to promote. So you can request approval. You can just click there, but I wouldn't. I'd write a little bit of note. If you're new, it's, it can be hard to get approved because you need a bit of a sales history. So don't bullshit in here. I see because I'm a vendor as well. You see, you actually see the responses, um, and some of them are absolutely ridiculous. People say they oh, they they make hundred thousand a week. They've got a million subscribers and all this sort of rubbish, and you, you know they've made no sales. So you know it's absolute crap. So you just be real. You put a link to it. this is set up your profile on Warrior Plus as well. Get a link to your social account. Start a YouTube channel. Um, something like that. To give people an idea, otherwise they're going to approve you. But you always write a little bit of a note in there as well. So that's how you go about it. Then you just click request approval. But I'll just go back here now and just show you an example of what I mean by the um, the funnel here. So I'll just have a look at Phoenix. This is one of the products that I promote regularly. This is a good product. It's a good um, list building product um, and money make making money online product that I often promote. Um, and it's a good good offer. And as you can see here, as you go into products. And you can see here the front end. And I've actually got commission bump on this as well. So I bought the reason I've got the well, I'm actually in the, the guy's coaching and mentoring programs to actually give me the bump. I didn't have to buy it. I bought into his high ticket program. But but um, yeah, so you can see the front end at 13 bucks. You know, I get 100 percent commissions on on that. But as you can see here, you know, 197, 80 percent. So I'm getting 150 dollar commission on that, whereas normally I'd get like 98 commission. Um He's even got like a 997 offer in there. Um, that's only 50% on that one. But, you know, like 197, you know, 67, you know, $53 commission. So you can see if you start getting three or four of these, you know, they soon add up to two, three, four hundred dollars And you can see, you know, it's very, very lucrative. So that's definitely a really good way of going about it. Okay, so... So that's number two, find high converting offers. And as I said, Warrior Plus there is a good place to do it, you know, and you're doing this, you can get those full funnel sales. So it's very lucrative as well. So, and the final step is to add in high ticket offers as well. So um, you're not just getting these front end sales, you know, $7, $12 sales, which sometimes when you're just getting those ticking over every now and again, it can be a little bit frustrating. Um, so when you're normally getting those seven to 17 sales, so you go to high ticket, and a lot of these high ticket, you can then get 250 to 500. Sometimes a thousand dollars and two thousand dollar commissions. Now there is more than that as well, big programs. Um, but you know, this is when you start adding a few of these in a week. Um, you're really improving your bottom line. You can start really making massive amounts of commissions and sales. So, so where do you find these? Like a lot of them are on ClickBank. So I'll give you an example. Like there might be there's John Cristani's program, um, John Thornhill's ambassador program. You can make those high ticket sales. There's a lot. There's a lot of um, 
high ticket offers on there that you can search for. Uh, I'm not going to show you how, but you can go in there and you can find that as well. There are ones on Warrior Plus as well um, that you can look for. Um, but a good one is if you actually buy into high ticket mentoring programs as well. So if you purchase high tickets, so one of them for me is like the Ministry of Freedom, John Armstrong's program. Like I got coaching and mentoring from him. Um, and his program, Ministry of Freedom, sells for fifteen hundred. Like I can get a thousand dollar commission on that because I've got a commission bump on that. Um, James Forster, the guy um, owner of Phoenix Reloaded, um, he's top one percent affiliate as well on on Warrior Plus. Um, he's now got a program that is selling for fifteen hundred dollars. You do about forty percent commissions of that, so you can get like a, a eight hundred dollar commission on that program as well. So. Um, it's a good idea, but not only, you know, you get coaching and mentoring from these top affiliates, you know, which is really going to help you out as well. Um, but also then you can promote their offers as well. So, and even um, as now myself and my business partner, Cynthia, have our own uh, high ticket offer, the super affiliate method, which sells for $1,500. Um, we offer 40% commissions on that, but for any of our students, we get 50% commissions on that. So, you know, you can make a $750 sale. On that as well. So if you're not only coming in getting high ticket um, or high end coaching and mentoring from us and all of our knowledge that we've um, learned to become top five percent affiliate, um, top five percent affiliates on Warrior Plus, you also can you know you make two sales of that offer. We show you how to go about promoting that as well. You know you've recouped your money back on that as well. And as I said before, you start adding these in, it can um, really add to your bottom line. So um, you know. You, it's um, a good idea to, you know, consider these programs because, you know, it, um, the people that are really successful online, it's funny, I got a, uh, an email from a guy called Darwin Islam and, you know, sometimes I don't 100% of everything he says, but what he did say is the most people that are successful not online, he doesn't know anyone that is successful online that actually hasn't got on board a high ticket coaching and mentoring program. And, I, and I've gone into several myself, so I definitely know um, it's definitely worth it. Um, but, you know, that's true. So it's something to consider and then you can promote that program and you, you know it's a good program. You can, you know, play, re, put, do reviews on the product, um, offer good bonuses on the product, uh, good ideas like offer, um, you know, one-on-one -on -one calls with people to purchase as well because they like your personal help as well. So there's a lot of ways to go about it that you can sell those high-ticket programs as well. So, but the way to go about it, like I said, you know, you're going to learn like a longer Email sequences, a lot of them have webinars or videos or they get on call. So, you know, you um, can do it that way. So you're going to need more of a longer email sequence to to do that. Um, also, you know, more value posts, more content, like, you know, longer reviews, um, you know, like organic posts on Facebook, you know, stuff like that as well um, to get people in, more content as well. It's a good way to get people in. So um, so that's it. That's basically the, the three steps to get increase your affiliate sales and commissions in 2023. And one thing you can see, definitely a lot more of this value stuff as well is going to come on board now, you know, branding, stuff like that, uh, and more value. And that's why I'm now doing more tutorials throughout this year and beyond, um, you know, just helping people out as well. And then, you know, you help people out, you know, they're more likely to come on board and buy your products, you know, because people buy from who they know, like, and trust. It's just, um, you know, the way things go. So uh, that's something to consider. So once again, build an email list, vitally important. Find these high ticket, high converting offers and also consider adding high ticket um, offers in there as well. So um, that's the three steps on how to increase your affiliate sales and commissions in 2023 in just three steps. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial and you got a lot out of it. So if you want some further information and more free training from me, there will be a link below in the description where you can enter your name and email address and you can get access to, as I said before, some more uh, cool training where I help you to build your business online. And if you are interested in working with us personally in our coaching and mentoring program where we can work with you um, much closer to help you achieve and smash your goals and build a successful online business, um, there will also be a, a link below as well where you can get access to a video where there's a very special invitation where you can join with us where we can help coach and mentor you and as I said before smash your goals so once again I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial um, and most importantly go out there and take action on it so you can start building your online business so um, I'm John from Make Money Online Affiliate Marketing Don com and also don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you can be updated when I would do another one of these training tutorials so uh, thanks very much I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in the next one cheers